that's the European Commission. That's in Brussels. That's where I am right now, but it's not where I'm going. Because uh, I figured I'm in Belgium. That means I'm where the B Next League is. And there's a B Next game on in Mechelen. So I'm going to go to that, check out Mechelen against Leuven. Uh, it's about an hour from here, door to door it says. Let's see how long it really takes me. And yeah, we, we, we wing it from there. So the reason it's called a B Next League is it's King Strong. Belgium and then Netherlands. Uh, we haven't yet made it a full Benelux League yet, no Luxembourg teams in, but um, essentially, so this is very convoluted system of games. They're already playing a national league system at first, so all the Dutch teams played each other, all the Belgian teams played each other. Now they're moving on to this phase, which is the gold and silver phase. So I'm going to a game in the silver division, which is for the uh, teams that finished 6th uh, to 11th in Belgium and 6th uh, to 9th in the Netherlands. But obviously it's your Belgian teams tonight. So all the teams in the top division, they're through to the playoffs no matter what. They're all just playing for seeding. But the teams in this division, the top three from each nation, they will still progress to their playoffs, their national playoffs. And from there, if they do well enough in their national playoffs, uh, they'll go into the B-Next playoffs. And so it's very confusing because there's like three champions per hand. There's the overall B-Next League champion, there's the champion of Belgium, and there's the champion of the Netherlands. But uh, this is a game that matters. They play up implications for both sides, essentially. Like, both really need a win to lock in uh, to make sure they're going to be playing in the postseason. And yeah, you know, we're on a journey. Because I'm here with having a fancy dinner. I've gone to Mahav, this is allegedly the small one, but I've got to walk this into me. They make the rest of the walk up to the gym. Well, isn't that a gorgeous sight? Vinket Kai, home of the kangaroos. Gonna see us on BNXT, B Next League action. Oh yeah. So we can see here the home team here warming up. Oh, I nearly revealed a kangaroo disguise there. We'll show you the kangaroo in a second. But uh, as you can see, we've got a lovely little gym here. There's no actual media seats as such. So I'll just grab a seat courtside right at mid court, cause why not? There's our kangaroo. What a legend. Go on, you good thing. Time out here in the first quarter. A uh, couple things you already noticed like they have the music still playing while the home team's on offense. You don't really see that like anywhere. Uh, conditioning here, you can see like that step up from they leave a garland, like where there's that extra level of conditioning here. Uh, one of the Lubin players took a big, big bump there. Clean bump, but a big one. Uh, yeah, like low score, but uh, good action so far. Really, really go for the whole atmosphere here. Great crowd if you haven't been able to tell behind me. I mean, the whole lot better as loud as I was expecting. I think that'll change in the second half a bit. But uh, I was expecting to be a bit louder. But uh, yeah, no, having a great night here, great game. Like, very, very physical. Like, love it. Like, I love it when it's a good TV beat you up at the game of basketball. And that's exactly what we're getting here.
half time here it's 47 31 for the home side um home crowd like they're i suppose kind of happy at the moment so far like you know kangaroo fella he's looking a bit you know nervous but they're up by 16. he's still you know got a bit more into it i think our, our mascot found here so they've got a great crowd here despite having some serious competition because it's champions league night in football and for context obviously it's half time now so a lot of these things are empty but they've been full for most of this game or all the game when it's been on and it's Champions League and football, which is of course a huge draw. But uh, for context, Basketball Champions League, which I'm a commentator on, did not go up against the Football Champions League. The B Next League, this game did. 8:30 tip. Pretty much a full house here uh, in Mecklenburg. You know, so the fans, they know they get out there for their team. First time out of the second half, and I'll be honest, Luba are making a mini comeback here. They've only knocked about, what, uh, five off the gap, but they have looked really good the last couple of minutes. So Holmes I'm calling a timeout here. They're still up by 11, though. the third 66-56 lead for the Kangaroos. Half court shot to win a prize. Oh, that's bad. They need to do something now, though. Oh, big block!
showing some love to the home fans here. Well, great win for the home side. Great crowd. Dev recommend taking it to BNXT League action. BNX League, as they call it. And yeah, an absolutely fantastic night of her in Mechelen. And we have learned, most importantly, that when a kangaroo fights a bear, a kangaroo wins. And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe. We'll catch you next time.